So, you've seen the vinyl come out. Well, not come out. Did you? Which? Uh, like vinyl records. Oh, yeah. I was, you watched them when they came out? No, no that was 1948 North. 1949, okay. so I was a little bit before my time. Okay. Um, you watched it transition to CDs. Yep. Uh, now into MP3s. Yep. Is, have you heard of anything that is coming up, or what do you feel as such a music addict? Well, these these are formats that people use to store and transport music. Uh, streaming is, is going to be the thing. So why do you need to possess anything, whether it be physical or virtual, when you can just pick up your smartphone and access any one of 35 million songs in seconds? Mm -hmm. So... Um, the, the digital formats from here on in are going to be irrelevant. It's just, can I access the music that I want here? Sounds very good. Um, so you believe it's just uh, going to stay something like MP3 formats? Um, there's well, not anything else that's going to... Well, that's that's interesting. I think what ha what's probably going to happen over a very long period of time is that as everybody transitions over to streaming, it's not going to matter what format the stream is in. I mean, there's AAC streams, there's MP3 streams, there's, you know, whatever. There's a bunch of different... Mm -hmm. Depends on, on whether you're dealing with Spotify, you're dealing with Pandora, whether you're dealing with uh, Apple Music. They're all different file formats. Mm -hmm. um, once everybody gets into the habit of streaming, you can update these file formats into something much more high fidelity or much more content-rich, and nobody will know the difference because you're just... It's like turning on a radio. Mm -hmm. 